welcome to this video guys in this video i will explain you how to model this sheet metal cone in solidworks and then how to get its flattened form that we can cut and fabricate so let's begin open a part file guys and from here change the background to plain white and then select here top plane and click on sketch that is very first option then select this circle and make a circle at this origin like this now let's define it for that select smart dimensioning tool and specify the diameter of this circle this is 100 millimeter this is the bigger di biggest diameter of the sheet metal now select here center line and make here a vertical center line select the center line and make sure that this is vertical for that specify your vertical relation and after that select here offset entities make sure that you have checked this bi-directional and this is one millimeter one millimeter because we want the cut of one millimeter here so check this box from here i will explain you this one millimeter cut later select here trim entities make sure that you have selected air power trim option and just cut this area and then select these lines and make it as construction geometry construction geometry means that these lines will be converted into dotted line or center line exit the sketch from here and this is our open sketch guys from here select plane and then select this top plane on which you have created the first sketch and here you need to specify 100 millimeter or the height of the cone in your case it can be different then a plane will be created now let's make a circle on this plane make sure you make this circle at the very origin now let's specify the diameter this is the smallest diameter of the cone which is 50 millimeter in my case and we will repeat few steps that we have done earlier make a center line make sure that it is straight and after that select your offset entities one millimeter this is one millimeter cut i will explain you later and here trim entities again and uh, we have trimmed these lines now make these two lines as construction geometry and these lines will be turned into dotted lines now hide this sketch because we do not have to do anything with the sketch right click here and go to tabs and just click here to enable the sheet metal tab when you click it sheet metal tab will be enabled and this is the option for the lofted band and in this window we need to select these two sketches one it will appear here and two it will appear here as well a cone will be created and there are options when we select this option it will create a rougher surface like this which we don't want in our case but you can select it in your case it's up to you this is the option for specifying the thickness in my case is 1.25 you can flip it inside or outside check this box from here and now let me specify some appearance so that it look better and this is the cut you can see this is the cut that i was talking about now select your right plane which actually cut this cone in half and click on sketch from here se select a center line make here a vertical and an inclined center line now press escape button select smart dimensioning tool specify the height of this line as 35 millimeter now select these two lines and the angle between them is 120 millimeter sorry 120 degree exit the sketch from here make sure that this is uh, extended than the cone from here select the plane select this line and select this dot a plane will be created simply check this box from here now select this plane and click on sketch actually i am going to make a hole here so that's why i'm doing these steps make a circle of 21 millimeter dia 
and uh, select here extruded cut command and from here we need to select up to next option up to next means it will only cut on one side and here is our cut simply hide this sketch and the plane because we do not have to do anything with the sketch and plane and uh, let me show how to flatten it when you select this flatten command it will get flattened and this is the flattened version you can save it into 2d fi file to cut uh, to laser cut it or it's up to you so that's how we create sheet metal cone in solidworks thanks for watching please subscribe my channel